I'm quite into my mini rod and reel setup. As you know, if you do follow my blog entries on a fairly regular basis, I've been putting it to good use recently for the likes of sticklebacks, bleak, minnows, even small chub on the River Severn. Today though, I'm on a still water and I've changed my tactics just slightly. I've gone for a slightly bigger hook and as you can no doubt see there, a bigger bait. I'm just about to cast out, or rather, should I say, drop the bait into the edge. You can see the corn sinking slowly through the water and the very small fish picking it up and they're running with it because it's very clear. You can see what's going on. Oh, and there you go. Once a, a, a bigger fish picks it up, then you know you've got what you came for and I'll show you that in due course. There it is. A nice fish on this particular approach on the tackle that I'm fishing with. A rud! That's my target for today. I've been catching small rud every cast or at least should I say I've had a fish on every time I've put the bait out there but I just saw, well, I saw it right in the surface layer as the corn hit the water. A perch, small one, about three ounces maximum, took the bait, briefly added it on but didn't connect with it. That would have been an interesting catch. That's the biggest one so far and as a get, again as I referred to just now on this particular tackle a fantastic fight. I had a lot of rud there genuinely lost count of the number of fish. I also had a few perch that were interested. I think they were looking at all those grains of corn that were going in and being taken by the rud thinking to themselves where's the worms where's the maggots i tell you what if you can't beat them join them it was great fun really enjoyed it and whatever type of angling you do ultimately the bottom line has to be enjoyment if you are fishing yourself of course tight lines but above all enjoy